let us discuss uh, the nature of contact between links in our previous video we discussed about nature of contact i mean uh, uh, nature of relative motion between the motion relative motion i mean nature of the relative motion between the links whereas now uh, we are going to discuss about nature of contact between links right so uh, that nature of contact between links divided into two category one is lower pair another one is higher pair the lower pairs which means the links have surface contact the links have surface contact the links have surface contact or area contact while transmitting motions for example uh, uh, sliding pair and turning pair or the screw pair uh, these things are comes under the lower pair even for uh, um, screw pair or uh, spherical pair uh, turning pair right uh, for practical examples uh, shaft rotating in a bearing see shaft rotating in a bearing or uh, piston reciprocating in a cylinder right see here uh, this is a fixed uh, link and uh, the link 2 is reciprocating with respect to the link 1 so this is uh, the surface contact right so then uh, the higher pair the links have the point or line contact while transmitting the motions for example uh, uh, ball bearings and uh, most of the gears have line contact and especially for helical gears have point contact and the cam with the flat follower uh, cam with fl flat follower for the example of uh, line contact uh, whereas cam with knife edge follower is an example of point contact okay and uh, the last one is mechanical arrangement again divided into two one is closed or self closed pair open or forced closed pair so self closed pair or closed pair which means the permanent contact between two links it forms a self closed pair all turning pairs all rolling pairs or comes under this closed or self closed pair whereas for the forced closed pair or open pair the forceful contact between the two links forms a forced closed pair all higher pairs or comes under this forced closed pair okay and now uh, uh, we will discuss about the types of joints in kinematic chain so types of joints uh, totally divided into three one is binary joint and the second one is ternary joint the third one is quaternary joint already we discussed in our video uh, the types of uh, links binary links ternary and quaternary here uh, we are discussing about uh, the joints right binary joints ternary and quaternary binary which means two links when two links are joined together at the same point or at the same connection then this type of joints are called binary joints whereas for ternary you see here this is link 1 and link 2 link 1 has two nodes link 2 has two nodes see the link 1 and link 2 joining at the same point right so this is a binary joint whereas for ternary three links are there link 1 link 2 and link 3 right so when three links are joined together at a connection so this type of joint is called as a ternary joint right whereas for quaternary joint four links are there link 1 link 2 link 3 and link 4 see when four links are joined together at a connection then this type of joints are called as quaternary joint right so this quaternary joint which is equivalent to the three binary joint right in general a formula is there l minus 1 so l which is equal to number of links for example quaternary joint four uh, links are there as we discussed earlier so 4 minus 1 which is equal to 3 so so 1 1 quaternary joint which is equal to 3 binary joint right similar to that 1 ternary joint ternary which means three links are joined at, at the same point right so this is link 1 link 2 link 3 so three links are joined at the same point then this is called as a ternary joint so one ternary joint which is equal to two binary so what is the formula l minus 1 so l which is equal to number of links which is equal to 3 for ternary joint minus 1 which is equal to 2 so two binary joints are there right so one quaternary joint which is equal to three binary joint and one ternary joint which is equal to two binary joint clear so now uh, let us discuss a problem uh, so this is a four bar chain and uh, uh, totally four links are there link 1 this is link 1 and link 2 link 3 and link 4 so totally four uh, links are there so now we have to find 
number of binary joints how many number of binary joints are there how many ternary zero ternary which is equal to zero for quaternary which is equal to zero but number of binary which is equal to four because link one and link 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 one uh, i mean link four link one and link four joined at the same point this is one ternary i mean one binary and link four and link three at the same point this is second uh, binary join and link 3 and link 2 uh, at the point c this is third one and for point b fourth one so totally four binary joins are there in four bond mechanism what about this example to number of binary joins see here point a one binary join and point b one binary join and point d one binary join so binary joint which is equal to 3 and here how many ternary joints are there point c and point e two ternary joints are there so two ternary joint which is equal to 2 into one binary joint which is equal to 2 so 2 into 2 4 so four binary joints because here we are converting ternary into binary so two ternary joint which is equal to four binary joint so 3 plus 4 which is equal to totally 7 binary joints are there so this is the answer 7 binary joints what about the last one example see how many binary joints are there first see at point d only one binary joint so binary joint which is equal to 1 first then let us uh, see um, for each corners see a a three three links are joined at point a so one ternary plus at point b one ternary right you have ternary one ternary and and point f one ternary so and point e one ternary so one two three four four uh, ternary joints are there four ternary joints so each joint uh, which is equal to how many uh, binary joints two binary joints so four into eight right so four ternary joints are converted into binary which is equal to 8 so plus 8 then now we are co going to consider uh, how um, uh, ternary joints see let us see how many ternary joints are there at point c one uh, quaternary sorry quaternary joint quaternary because four links are joined at point c similar to that uh, here at g point one more quaternary is also there Uh, 11 10 8 7 so four uh, links are joined at point g so this is also one of the quaternary joint right and uh, one more um, see point f link uh, 9 8 6 oh sorry is a ternary uh, g t k Okay, two quaternary totally. So two quaternary into so one quaternary which is equal to how many binary? Three binary. So which is equal to two into six. Sorry, two into three six. So plus six. So one plus eight plus six, which is equal to fifteen. Right. So totally fifteen binary joints are there in this case. Okay. so one more problem also we'll discuss about uh, uh, to find the number of binary joints right so in this case how many binary joints are there so totally first we have to calculate how many links so link 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 so total number of uh, links total number of links which is equal to 9 right so now we are going to calculate how many binary joints so first we have to consider how many binary joints first see point f one binary joint is there so b uh, similar to that point c one more binary joint because link 4 and link 5 joint at the same point c so this is also one of the binary joint so in either binary joints no so so totally two binary joints are there two plus now we are going to calculate ternary joints so ternary joint which means three links uh, joined together at the same point So link one, link two, and link three join at point A. So this is considered as one ternary joint. And point E, sorry, point uh, D, uh, link seven, six, five. So three links are joined at point D. So this is one ternary joint. So total are totally two ternary joints are there. 
so 2 into 1 turner joint which is equal to how many binary joints 2 so 2 into 2 4 so 4 plus so now we are going to calculate how many quaternary joints see uh, uh, look at into the point C so link 8 link 2 link 9 and link 7 these four uh, links are joined at point E right so this is one quaternary joint and uh, uh, take a look on point B link 3 link 9 link 6 and link 4 these four links are joined together at point B so this is one more quaternary joint see totally two quaternary joints are there two quaternary joint which is equal to uh, how many binary joint two into one quaternary which is equal to three right so two into three which is equal to six so plus six see totally how many binary joints are there four plus six ten ten plus two 12 binary joints are there clear so this is way we are going to calculate the number of binary joints in the problem okay thank you